Hi guys, this is Bars and welcome back to First Lozy and I'm here with another new tutorial. This one is a quick tutorial. You can say this is a two-minute Photoshop tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to place your design in anything like um, in a, in a mock-up, in a book cover, box or in a wall or maybe in a chair too. So let's get started. So here it is, we can put this design in this box, in this little box and I want to do this in a correct way, in a right perspective and also I want to look it real. Doing this using transformation tool is a little bit hard and also time consuming. So let's see how to do it without using the transformation tool and in the easiest way, of course, it's a correct way. So for this, just active your design layer press and hold command on or control key and select the design layer you can see it is selected now press control and c to copy it now press control and d to deselect it and hide the layer and here create a new layer okay now go to the filter and select your vanishing point and you'll find a new window just select this tool the perspective tool or here you see create panel tool and now just click on any is and just on the opposite one click and this one and this one so here is the square and you can fix the edges to like this click on this little square and easy right and you can find another square here here and here in the middle so here I want to select this area and this area right so press and hold command or control key and go to the middle square or middle box and just click and drag like this look it's very easy it's done and again select this one press and hold command or control key and just drag like this it's done and now look at this the box is selected okay look at this it's done and now just drag and place your design like this look at this look at the perspective it looks really neat that's great now press ok here and since the blending mode to multiply now look at this look at this this is the before and this is after look at this this was the before actually and this it's very easy you can always decrease the opacity from here or you can use the blending option from here the underlying layer look at the edges oops oops I don't find the right way to show you I think this is fine okay now press and hold alter to split this one and just look at this you can see the light source from here so I want little bit lighter on this corner I think this is fine so it's done look at this it's beautiful it's very easy and it's really very beautiful. so I hope you love this technique and if you love this tutorial please hit the like button leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe